going to talk for a minute. So, once upon a time, when I was 15, in my town in Hermosa Beach, I used to be able to go and sit on the floor in the practice room of a band called Black Flag. And, and, uh, and uh, I got to watch them practice when I was just still in high school. And uh, they, they, later they ended up sharing their practice room with us, with Descendants, and so that kind of started this little community of band, the bands in the South Bay in, in the Hermosa Beach area. And uh, so here we skip ahead 40 years, and uh, my, my sort of, uh, my, my sort of uh, biggest influence a, a, as a, a drummer, I suppose, or my, kind of my mentor, the person that I looked up to the most, um, he, he happens to be here tonight. And, and I, I've, not, I've not seen him, it, it, it has been uh, 18 years since I saw him, and he's here tonight. And also, with him, he brought another one of my very dear friends and mentors, and the two of them are gonna play a couple songs with us. And uh, so who am I talking about? I am talking about Robo. Robo, are you here? Everybody say hi to Robo. And Dezo. Robo, holy shit. You can't imagine how many hours I spent learning how to play drums, playing along with Robo. Awesome. Amazing to have both of these guys in the same room. And Denzo, who I get to tour with all the time, so. Pretty much. Pretty much. And you know, Denzo here sang on the original version of In My Band, right? He sang the backing vocals. And, I, and all logistics. And all logistics. In fact, another side note is that Carl Alvarez and I, our guys play, right? We grew up in Salt Lake City, Utah. Wow. The fuck is that, right? And one of the, the, the first sort of independent e punk rock show put on by normal humans for all ages people was Black Flag, June 20th, 1981. Des his last show singing with Black Flag before he moved to guitar and Robo. So I actually got to see that four piece lineup for Black Flag in my hometown. And so did Carl. And we were really sore the next day from the pit that ensued, as you can imagine. Getting a history lesson is because we gotta fix the drums. <laughs> and that is totally the truth, right there. Robo has the chance to build the second to bring song, Bill's battle instead of the other way around. The second song is gonna be called Touch Screen. You gotta touch the screen, you gotta touch the screen.
drinking? Ready for some drinking?